what is up what is up what is up fs club guess what guys fs daily news hopefully you guys are all having an amazing holiday season uh two more days till christmas guys only two more days but we got a lot of news to go over if you guys haven't already done it make sure you guys put in the comment section below hashtag fs daily news if you guys have not followed us on twitter make sure you guys do it at fs club xbox or on facebook at fs club console first bit of news is from nmc uh this is going to be test well they actually sent this off to testing now this is the nmc center mount lt46 it's going to be for all platforms, PC, PS4, Xbox One. Uh, so this looks really, really good right here. Uh, they put posted on there saying that this is a logging trailer is the most versatile logging trailer that NMC produces. This trailer not only gives you gives you a way to transport your logs to the mill, but it also allows you the ability to load them as well. With this patent triple bunk design, the NMC Center Mount LT46 is ideal for small scale logging, but equally useful for large scale logging. So this looks really, really good. I don't do much forestry, but I know a lot of people do, and they're going to be very happy with this. Okay, next bit. The Gallagher 9250 SL. Here is another picture of, picture of this. This is, of course, from Mining FS. Looks really, really good. Okay, and the next one is by Stoneway. Uh, they are actually going to be bringing out the Lizard, uh, like a Lizard branded uh, gravity wagon. So, cannot wait for this. A lot of people have been waiting for this now. Uh, next thing, these next four are really, really big news right here. First is from Creative Mesh, the people that brought us Star Harvest in FS17. Of course, they're going to be bringing the add-on to FS19. Uh, they posted this yesterday. Uh, they said, before we get to Christmas days, we have a GIF for showing you the Crone Krampama. You can see the different bell sizes you can press with Krampama as well as Nally, now fully animated novel grip, depending on the fill level. PC and consoles. So this is going to be coming to consoles too. Uh, they said, we wish you all a happy holidays and healthy start into the new year. We'll bring you more news about the add-on straw harvest in 2020, so stay tuned. I cannot wait. I cannot wait to see uh, what comes to console. Yes, cannot wait for this. Probably said that a lot. Okay, next one. Another big one right here, guys. Shabba is working on a map. It's called the La Cronella, I believe it. that's how you say it. But guys, there's going to be one big difference with this map. And that big difference is this map will have cheese production. A uh, lot, lot of PC people are you know, used to you know, the factory mods and everything. We don't have this kind of stuff on console, so this is really big. Uh, so cheese production without a script, so you could definitely come to console. So basically you put in the milk and you get cheese. So that is awesome. He said, uh, cheese production without a script in La Cronella, running without problems. For my part, it's finished. In the hands of giants will be so you can enjoy it both on PC and consoles. I cannot wait to see this. Uh, this has just became one of my most anticipated things now in FS19. Okay, so there is that one, another big one. Black Sheep Modding. Uh, yeah, they are bringing out the Valley of the Old Farm. It is coming back, guys, but it remember, they said it could take up to six months, so probably sometime in the summertime when it is released. But yeah, I, this is probably one of my favorite maps. This one in Drummerd from FS17. Let me know in the comment section below which one was your guys' favorite mats in FS17. Okay, the other big news is really big, and of course it had to be from Oxygen Dave, and you know him. <laughs> so here is the next news, guys. Wow, wow, wow. <laughs> Here's a whole bunch of pictures on it. Let me just read you what Oxy said, and yeah. Uh, he said, hiya guys, I would just like to wish everyone a happy Christmas and a new year. It's been a great year in Farming Simulator. I want to thank you all for the support, feedback, and comments you have been amazing. As an early Christmas present, I would like to show you with my latest projects. I have listened to you all feedback and this map will include, there will be three farms, two pastures for sheep and two pastures for cows, beef and dairy, uh, two cell points, snow missions. That is something new with season. I cannot wait to see how that's implemented in the game. Uh, four, faster than default traffic uh, speed for traffic, super fast on the motorway. So basically on the highways, it's going to be a lot faster, so watch out. Uh, loads of new models, animations, and textures, as you guys can see in these pictures. He, of course, has his new lighting engine on it. Uh, expect to see AI tractors, not just on the roads this time, but in the fields working outside the map boundary. That's going to be cool. I, I wish you can actually see it actually inside them, inside or whatever, so... That'd be kind of cool. This map is still a work in progress and still a long way off from being complete, but I plan to release it in early 2020 for console and PC. Welcome to Sandy Bay 19. Oh, wow. <laughs> wow, wow, wow. I cannot wait for this map. Looks amazing, Oxy. Looks really good. So guys, that is the news for today. Uh, let me know what you guys are excited about. This might be the last FS daily news before 
Christmas. So hopefully you guys do have an amazing Christmas. Uh, hopefully you guys get whatever you guys want for Christmas. Spend some time with the hot friends, family, whatever. And I will should be streaming Thursday, guys. Thursday I should be streaming. Remember, guys, if you guys did like the video, make sure you guys do pound that like button. If you have not done, make sure you guys do. And like always, have an all-day, farmers. Peace. Thank <laughs> you.